Welcome back. An exciting series. Um, obviously, an incredibly important matchup for both of these teams. Again, so far, so good. Trading. And good amount of damage there onto Taiga, although Arteezy also getting low, trying to dodge away. Not going to happen. Amar also very low, going toe-to-toe -to -toe now with Artur and with the idol, and <laughs> actually has to run away. Oh, and then another round of Firestorm. Mar trying to play, and Jerax also up close. Blood right afterwards. It's not quite enough. They turn to fight, but it's not going to be there. <laughs> A quick kill. That was close. Uh, another round look at of mid lane. BZM. Oh, Hobbit getting right on top of him. This could be it. They get run down, a rotation comes too late, and... I think both offlaners are kind of playing like carries. Obviously, Nightfall is a, a carry player. Um, maybe they'll force PCM to use the haste here. Oh, nice tackle. Pops it, and now trying to turn, looking for the kill. They find him right there. Cold Embrace, not nearly enough. And Abed has to this back away, but the boat dropped down, and no refraction, no Ooh. nothing. Abed drops. Seb now looking for more Jerax some trouble as well as he's going to get pulled back and OG making it work here early as they rotate many heroes mid and get a couple of clutch kills. Yoragi, is he going to go down here? Arteezy doesn't want to go for any more. They are going to go on in bottom lane here on Arteezy. Looking for the kill bottom, although actually they're going for Seb Whoa. as well and yeah, Artur is dead. Up top again, they're going to drop the arena, but Seb just TPs out, not going to be able to get out of time. Damage. And Yoragi. they're contesting these stacks too here. Draghi got a couple of them. Has the X, the TP rotations coming in. BZM is right there. So they will <laughs> lose the IO. Crit just dies to Amar. And now looking for Nightfall. I mean, if he goes down, this is really tragic. Yuragi running in with almost no HP. And, well, the Torrent, it's going to lift up one. Tries to dodge away. Nightfall living for a very long time with the Cold Embrace. But I don't think it's going to be long enough as eventually they bring him down. And again, Arteezy comes in too late. <laughs> It looks a bit sad. Yeah. Uh -oh. Using the Fiend's Gate here. Running at him. Just keep going. Wait, wait, oh, what? you bullies. <laughs> How? Oh, no. Dude, that was sick. That was uh, so good. That was his, this uh, Fiend's Gate. Well, very well. Pushes in Yuragi, but the black hole used the first time, and they didn't have level six yet on Jerex because of how bad that lane has gone. He even got the tome. Didn't matter. And now Crit, he's going to be X. Pulled back in in just a moment, and, well, tries to tether away. They do manage to get Crit out of there. Are they going back in now? Um, Yuragi died during all of this. Okay. I think they want to defend their IO here. Interesting. Winner's Curse is available. Do they manage to find an opening for anybody, though? Trying to stay alive. Crit dead, and there's the Winner's Curse now. Trying to bring the BZM. This is a big kill. Amar gets the <laughs> bonus damage, which means he hits him harder. And they find that finish. Seb slowed down. Abed clapping at him. I'm coming for you now. Shackle shot is not going to latch on, and suddenly a resurgence comes out here. Although, again, Arteezy in some trouble. Cold Embrace keeping him alive. Abed, Nightfall, move back in. He's trying to get through the Fiend's Gate and the Torrent to keep him out of there. Yuragi now in some trouble. He might have wanted to run through the Fiend's Gate as well, as they can't chase down he's, that Kaka. Oh, he's back in. Back. Round two. Here, <laughs> runs away. Nightfall going to be left alive. I, I want to see it. All right, on it. We will hear you. Thank you very much. BZM, he's going to get ruptured. Might get a high five here in a moment. Well, we'll see as the chase down is there. And Arteezy able to get involved and almost get the kill. Oh, is BZM not going to die? BZM's Are you standing. kidding me? What? Are you kidding? No. Oh, my Where goodness. Where is this gate taking us? Okay. Yeah, they got to back out. Well, they're at least farming up. And Nightfall able to blink right over the top. Blood right comes out afterwards. Oh. What? The Gale Force. Gale Force. Just pushes him away, and the Winter's Curse. It's not going to be enough to get a kill there. Mar turns now, wanting to fight, and there's going to be the catch with the Shackle. The relocate comes too late. Io gets out of there. Nightfall has to back up. And eventually, this Io is going to get pulled on in five. again. Yeah, there you go. High five. Getting ready for it. As they want to try and get the pit in the midst of the tether, but don't even need to. Another kill for Amar. Um, it looks like OG's just going to let this one go. Tiger's TPing. Or, yeah, he's okay. moving in. Danger, danger. Jerex there to try and stop this. Can they take the fight that they need? Malefice already down. Has Blink Dagger up in a little bit. Amar just walks right in, and he's going to try to take this down. Oh, goes for the kill, and then Abed able to snatch the Aegis. So they do get the Aegis onto EG, but have to back out afterwards. They're gonna die in three heroes still, and they didn't even get the Roche kill. Oh, this man. does not feel good. 
Yeah, that's a it's a big problem. OG, they showed up. They knew that they could win this fight, and they will take down three heroes in Abed, just hoping to get away. Has the Invis rune at least still working for him? Uh, good recognition from OG to bring in people to help, and then also make rotations and start getting into fighting shape as... Well, Rupture. Mar does not appear to care that much. Shackle is going to latch now on for the IO, and... I and mean, Arteezy just runs away, the tether back from Crit, trying to escape. BZM rolling in from downtown, finds him, separates the two, and then the pushback Tiger there for the Malefist. EG found again. OG's just doing whatever they want. Oh, man. I mean, a Fiendsgate play if they want to when they look for this black hole. Radiant but scanning. Ragi gonna run into Jerax right away. This is not the hero that you want to find the Gale Force. Where are y'all going? BKB tries to run away. Nightfall is there. Wraith pack. Tiger's got him. The Wraith pack is out. Can they do any more afterwards? Oh, God. Crit's in trouble. They got him caught. He's going to fall as well. Just like that, they get a couple more. I mean, BZM's still on Arteezy as well. Yuragi is right there on top of him. A couple more punches. The power shot from downtown and OG. They're not losing anybody. It's it's looking really rough for them, definitely. They, they need all the control. They need some free time. Abed goes on in, accidentally right-clicks the creep, and instead just gets black hole, but they're able to break it. This is about the best that you could hope for for EG, and even that is not looking great. Nightfall going to get focus-fired. Gale Forest, he's the pushed five, around. He's pulled in. Give me some high fives. Right before you go off to the grave. And uh, <laughs> just that, that smile, that dang smile. Jerax needs to be careful. The gem spots it out in Malefist. Keeping Nightfall back again. And BKB popped. Amar right there Wait, on Amar top of the Jerax. The Fiend's gated right on top of him. But the spear, is it going to be enough to get Jerax away? No. He dies to the Underlord. And now Abed is also caught. He is going to get rolled on. 23,000 gold lead, and again, EG, they can't protect their wards, they can't protect Roche. Taiga has been doing a great job of pushing the sidelines constantly with these Eidolons, so the waves were always in, in a good position for uh, OG. As oh no. Said, maybe he'll drop the high five now, okay. Well, it went a bit far there, but if they can get a return kill, this would be big. Oh no, this is not the way they want it to go. BZM has to back out, Seb. Or, excuse me, Crit, <laughs> a little bit of a mix-up there, is going to end up falling on the IO. And, well, now OG, they want some retribution. Arteezy's going to get pushed Wait. up to the high ground. <laughs> but then afterwards, well, round two, Amar is just going to beat him down to death. They hit the winner's curse off. BZM is doing almost nothing to Amar as they back away. And now an X, they find Jerex. He does have Winter's, oh, no more Winter's Curse, but the Cold Embrace. And eventually, OG, as they storm up, look for more. Why not? 27,000 gold lead. Uh, despite obvious, uh, the obvious disaster that is happening. Um, but yeah, I, I think at this point they're just... I, I assume there's not much being said or they're trying to think about the next game because this one looks pretty over. Uh, somebody probably made the call that let's just wait for Roche and we're not going to throw this. Okay. Jumps in. Arena down. Finding one. And Seb pays... The price gate. this time, maybe not. Oh, okay, okay. He does end up going down. Mar is there. The torrent onto two. Nicely played there. BZM going to get the roll. The spear connecting to the cliff. Keeps a little bit of distance from Nightfall, but he's still in some trouble. And Tiger just waiting to the side, ready for a black hole. And, and GG's done. Yeah, it's, it's over. Oh, man. A lot of exciting team fights to come. A ton riding on this match. So much can still happen in the group stage. Lots changed, but some things are going to remain the same for a little bit at least. And Sunstrike, Arteezy. Oh, oh nice. nice. Well nice. done. Oh, that hurt. Recognizes that, and he's coming here. You know, oh. they are going on top, though. Oh, no, and the body blocks are there and spearing him. Oh, now the man. sun strike, and Arteezy goes down a second death. Mid, they realize we got to make something happen. Looking for BZM, trying to get the kill. Will it happen, though? He's getting so much regen from those quas, but it won't be enough. Abed now underneath the tower, taking the tower shots, and they're going to throw out some of the fire spirits, but will it be enough to get Abed killed? Power shot, couple more punches. Yuragi gets it, gets level six off of this. Could rupture if he wants, but won't opt for it. Just trying to give that information while Taiga comes back top. Yeah, this is important. They need to punish these, like, really aggressive farming patterns coming from the Enigma. Yeah, here it comes. Locks the chase. Oh. Cancels it now, and instead it's a rupture. Jerex. He's the one that's in a little bit of trouble. They're going to drop the supernova just to protect Jerex. And the power shot, not quite there, but the spear comes out. 
and the Ragi is the one that actually got the final kill with the Thirst on the other side. Well, Abed able to kill off Seb. Crit goes down after. So, Ichi is going to try to wrap around here. Abed runs into Seb. They spot Yuragi on the other side, but at least for now, they're just going to go for the one kill. Jarex looking for more. Oh, and Arteezy <laughs> finds them, and the, with the shard, the it means that they can't get out of there. <laughs> oh my god, Sprout TZ is back in a good way. See if EG decide to come and defend this ward that they have. Seb walks up the hill, drops down the sentry, spots it immediately. They got vision and the arena down. What's the follow up though? BKB reaction. They're right on top of him. Amar starting to drop, leashed up onto two. Amar almost dead. Will he die as they run in and actually find him? Now Seb also in some trouble. Yuragi tries to get her. They miss on the sprout. Crit backs away. Two for one though is the trade. Drops the arena, drops the spear. Oh. Arteza gets the BKB off. Or Abed. Yuragi. Right there onto Yuragi, trying to pick up a free one. If he had a Sunstrike, it'd be perfect, but doesn't quite. And Yuragi jumps away. And now, the afterwards, the turn, the black hole. Oh, no, for Abed. Oh, man. Uh, Wraith Pact online. Let's go. Yep. This will be the difference. Uh, you got to love that item. Yeah. I, I'm not a, <laughs> still not sure about it, but... Uh, <laughs> it's probably better this game, actually, as bottom. Whoa, 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 BZM. Okay. Chill out, buddy. <laughs> oh, my God. OG smoked up. They have the BKB and Amar. They do have a gem purchased, actually. So this is very oh, all-in. Arena there onto both. Sunstrike not going to connect because of the Gale Force. A little bit of miscommunication there. Nightfall might survive through it because of it. BKB on Amar afterwards. Now running in, wanting to find a kill. Yuragi right on top of the Phoenix, but the egg does come out. Do they have any way to protect it? No. They can't keep it alive, so it will go down, but the counter kill is big for EG. They take down two. I think that's the... Wait. Nightfall? <laughs> oh. Oh my god. Dice to the meatball. They just ran in and took him out. Never mind. And now it's easy. He's really low too. Ooh, Sunstrike isn't quite going nice to connect. Try. Good attempt. But yeah, this invoker is, uh, you know, you're playing for that YouTube compilation video okay. type of thing. Uh, drop the meatballs. Oh my goodness, the damage. Yeah, he's doing a ton. That Silver Edge, really good stuff. But likewise, when you see the Alacrity hits. You know, like he didn't want to preemptively use it. Right. Because he thought he's going to be fine, but clearly not. And now Arteezy, no BKB, but Silver Edge gets him away, walks back in, turns to the fight. Percent. A huge kill. That is exactly what EG needed. Can they find any more afterwards, though? This Wraith Pact just making a little bit of a disco mood around the egg area. And, well, turn now, trying to punch, gain a kill on the big black hole onto two the Supernova. It's going to come too late. They don't have enough. Nightfall survives through it. Taiga starting to get dropped back down low. They come back to life, though, onto Arteezy, and... Well, they back away again. This one, he is definitely on top. Top net worth. We'll see if he can keep making plays for his team. Uh, Taiga looking for an opening here as well. Although obviously, doesn't have the black hole. Meatball down and Abed dead. Got to run away with the rest of them. EG has to get out. Sunstrike. They spot crit. But can they take down the bird? Hiding away. Has the sun ray out of there. But just leads an easy path where they find and eventually kill off the Phoenix. Crit is right on top of them, as well as Arteezy. They don't quite break the smoke there, but they spotted the blood right. Crit's in the area. Power shots down. They reveal themselves now. Dive out and away. Bale Force Amar, already no down, BKB. but they got him caught with the stun. Doesn't have an answer at all. Pulled back in. Taunt dead before the fight even starts, but Arteezy's also Arteezy goes down. So they use their stun trying to fight the other angle, and he doesn't have buyback, so he can't get back into this. Crit now in a ton of trouble. Oh, EG, they've got to get out of here. They are falling one by one. They lose three. Oh, and just a little bit off the mark with that. And now uh, it spawns almost immediately. Best case scenario for EG if they're gonna will they're willing to trade, but BZM's keeping back. Got to be careful. Hex is there. Nightfall for the turn, though. Tries to make this work. But the, the black hole! Oh, the oh can they keep him alive, though? Through it, the oh, supernova down is good enough to turn it. And with the Satanic, they fight down and take down Taiga. So a really big turnaround there with the black hole used. And Seb's going to be the one. They spot him. Jump in, stun. Fireball down and dead. BZM, does he decide to fight this? I mean, he gets the lift up onto two. There's no BKB on RTZ. I this, swallowed this down. Dangerous here. Has to get out. They have to run. Nightfall pops his BKB and just going to TP out of there. So the rest of them try and escape. And it looks like the rest of EG should get out of there. It's sticking around, you know? Oh, yeah. Maybe it gives them the high five before, but... Okay, good TP out. BZM is on the hunt here. 
Oh, God. And there it is. The hex is there. Wow. Nice the shackle. Shot. Everything dropped down in the cataclysm to boot. BZM hoping to escape. They get the lift up now. No buyback available on the Nature's Prophet. And with that, Abed going to TP out of there. And can they get one last kill? They will. So they lose two. Oh, man. And Seb now. A crit, excuse me. Trying to get away from Yuragi. Does look like he's going to be able to make the escape. But they've got to wait uh, until they're all back up to go for any type of a fight. But OG recognizing this moment when they've got the strength, they're in the upper hand. Uh, Egg's still on cooldown for 15 seconds. So if the fight breaks out now, Taiga might get a free black hole. Oh no, jumps in and finds it, and it is going to be a free black hole. The Cataclysm down, connects onto both. They did not have the answer. Taiga getting tipped by Seb, appreciating some greatness. Uh, you know, this hero only needs one, and he does have a refresher now. Smoked up behind, ready to go for round two. EG want to take them all down. Amar backs out, but they're moving in. They have the refreshed black hole available. The if Enigma. they can get there in time, get together and catch them all. Tommy does it to him one more time again. Another tip, another win. OG, they're looking stellar. Wow, what a black hole. <laughs> they did not expect that. Just comes with the refresher. And now I think EG is just, they're just done here in this game. He'd fall. Oh, look at him. Oh, he's feeling it. He's oh, feeling man. it. They go in again. OG going to call it now 2-0 over Evil Geniuses in just an absolute fabulous performance.